Hello, everybody. Good buddy Q. Oh my God. Good buddy Q here with Lobo. Oh, you okay? Oh, I just I I know that face. I know where that face comes from. I hate this stuff. So, welcome to Hit Alternate. No, it is not pronounced Hit Alternate. This is Hit Alternate. The alternate stole the A. D shame on them. Get it? Because it replaced it. Yes, I get it. Also, <laughs> <laughs> I hate it. So, I, Lunar Projections, Darling Satanist, and Gay Sun, made this demo for Air's Hitophobia Game Jam. That's it. <laughs> I hate it. Oh, I, you hate it. I hate the image, specifically. It's very good, it's very well done, but I also know where that's from, and I hate the original image, too. Thank you. Uh, so, yeah, this is only a demo, and... Uh, uh, lunar coded this, so that's why it's an MV this time. Uh, can we get off of this screen? Okay. It's off. Before you begin, refrain from button mashing or clicking out of the game during dialogues in scenes. You don't mess with the flow. Yeah, we're not sure why that happens, but... Oh, it happens. To it used to happen to me, too, sometimes. If you click too fast, it'll just break the game. Enjoy. I won't. Ah. I thought you'd like it. It's based on the Mandela catalog. Oh, I know full well what it is. Well, the audience Hello. doesn't. Oh. And on behalf of the United States Department of Temporal Phenomena, Thank you for your interest to pursue the ever-growing supernatural threat in <laughs> County. Before we can properly sort your paperwork, you must submit your test of your knowledge of the unknown. But first, an icebreaker personality test for us to get to know you. How are you? Good or bad? I'm nervous, so I guess bad? What's your favorite ice cream? Vanilla or chocolate? Vanilla. Vanilla. What's your blood type? I am B positive. Oh. I'm O. What's your favorite animal? Dog, cat, parrot, amorphous shame. Was that supposed to be shape or shame? No shame. Cat. Kitty. What's your favorite limb? I like my arms. That seems to be a common answer. Do you believe in a higher entity? Yes, no, or many? Yes. Yes. Thank you. Now that we are a little more aware of what you are like, part one of the test will begin. This will test your knowledge of what the threat coming to <laughs> County is. It will consist of five questions. Begin. What's the title of the hostile organism? Alternate Thaxalin Chupacabra Bye Bye Man. Oh, that's easy. It's A, an alternate. He looks like he hasn't slept in 30 years. Maybe it assimilates, drives victims to insanity, eats all the food in your fridge, or can kill him with the force of 10 men. Oh, obviously the food one's not true. Do they even eat food? A lot of them don't have mouths, so how even could they? Answer's gotta be C. What should you not do if there's a threat? Stay home, leave the television on, lock all the doors and windows, have access to a loaded firearm or ranged weapons at all times. Hmm. Oh yeah, there's a type of alternate that kidnaps kids through televisions, right? If one's around, probably not that one then, so it's gotta be B. <laughs> Of the think principle. When you see a threat, what does K stand for? Know your place. Kill yourself, karate, or kiwi. I was feeling fruity when I named him. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I know this one. Uh, tell me if I'm a nerd figure. Hinder an alternate's movement. Identify the class type. Neutralize the alternate. Oh, shoot, what was the last one? I was going to this one. Uh, oh, it's know your place in reality. A. Hey. What class type is this? Doppelganger, unspeakable, flawed impersonator. C. Oh, pfft. Obviously a type 3. C. That's way off the mark of looking like a person. Definitely a flawed impersonator. Thank you. That concludes part one of the test. The next part of the test is about the psychological phenomenon that oh, no. has been known to spread. Begin. What's up? What does MAD stand for? Mad aardvark disease, metaphysical awareness disorder, micro arm dwarfism, or mango avocado delusion? <laughs> B. Oh, oh, I know this one. Metaphysical awareness disorder. B. How is MAD contracted? Sexually transmitted, leaked by a phantasm, exposure to verbal information, or being burnt by a ritual candle? I'd hope it's not the first answer. Please don't bang the alternate. 
I know there's some corners of the internet that'd be interested, but no. Pretty sure it's exposed to forbidden knowledge, one. See? What is the suicide rate? Three. Twenty-three point five. Forty-eight. Ninety-seven. <laughs> <laughs> I love how that's been the reaction every time so far. I love it. If it wasn't a problem, it probably wouldn't be that low. Probably the right answer is the highest percentage. Yikes. D. What two spiritual concepts should one avoid if afflicted? Religion and philosophy, God and devil, Christianity and Buddhism, Marxism and capitalism. Hmm. I mean, they're all branches of the first answer, so... Maybe the first one? Oh boy, you're getting tougher. A. What is the best way to keep your mental stability intact? Looking after your loved ones, eat your feelings, retail therapy, binge watch streaming services. Uh, shit, I actually don't know this one. I'm sure all these are right their own way. Thank you. That concludes part two of the test. The last part of the test is about assessing the physical oh, form of the threat. Oh, this is gonna be the rough part. On screen, two images will appear. On instinct alone, please choose the image which is the most unsettling. Begin. You get to answer this one. Which one's the most unsettling, left or right? Uh... The left, because she has no mouth. Uh, the left again. Uh, oh, God! Right! Uh, right again. He's melting. Oh, right! <laughs> Left! Congratulations. You passed the test. Your score will not be disclosed for data protection purposes. Alright! Yeah! A win! It did a win-win! It will come for you in a wizard. Don't go outside. Don't talk to anyone. Don't, don't open the doors. Don't answer calls. If you are not contacted within seven days, pray. Good luck. Ominous. Alfred, what you up to? Hmm? Oh, hey, Philly. Hello. Taking a personality test? Oh, what'd you get? Are you a fire fairy or a water dragon? Oh, this just ain't any personality test, Philly. This is a test to be part of a supernatural team in America to take on the alternates. The what? What are those? Oh, uh, they're these creatures that kill people and take their place by pretending to be them. Hence, being an alternate of the original person they're pretending to be. Uh huh. Alfred, is this one of those creepy pastas you've been reading into? Remember what happened last time? Huh, what? No, 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 no! This isn't any Jeff the Killer horror story stuff. This is real! We got some cases that seem eerily similar to them in some of my states. I have some towns in Wisconsin that's having a really strange decline of population that's super unexplained for the longest time. It's spreading further out, too. Considering, you know, I'm a nation, I should at least try to help my people, you know? So, I ordered this test, and I should get my answer soon if I can join. Huh. Neat then. A fun hobby, I guess. Ah, sorry. Ah, too spooky for me, honestly. Yeah, it is. But someone's gotta do it. Yeah, you're so brave. Thank you. It's probably good I got you between stuff. I'm going to go to the church back like with our community Bible group and pastor. Will you be ready to go soon? Oh, is that this Friday? You forgot, didn't you? Yes, yes it is. You forgot. Well, if it's okay with you, could I skip out on it? Uh, how come? Honestly, I don't really know a lot of people there like you do. I'd rather work on these file cases if it's all the same. Mm, I mean... You can't get to know people if you don't try. Okay. I'll try to bring back anything yummy they bring over that's left over. Thanks, 
You're the best, boo. Call me when you want to be picked up, okay? I know you how you get it with walking home in the dark. Uh, the, thank you, Miss Delina. Pack, pack. <laughs> See you in a few hours. Try not to get too obsessive with the spooky stories. If I have to dig you out of the bathtub again, I'm going to be very upset with you. You know me. I won't. Hopefully. Right. Where did I leave off? And if you sold your kidneys on eBay again, I'm going to be upset. No, that was one time and that was to buy Tears of the Kingdom. Oh you God. know that. They will come for me within a week? Huh. They? Oh, the group probably. Wow, not bad of a turnaround time. Now let's see. The Maple Magazine wiki will probably have more research material I can study up on on the meanwhile. Yeah, I know what the, what's up. <laughs> few hours later. Huh. Neat. Note to self, I should probably visit Odessa, Texas sometime. Do not go to the flesh pit. That's where he will see the amorphous shame. But I do not want him going to the flesh pit. I know what happens when he does. But, but Coke th Throb is so yummy. Shut the... Mm. <laughs> Holy crap, how'd I get late already? I should probably get some to eat. I wonder if it's in the fridge. But first, I should probably save my progress on my computer, just in case one of my programs crash. That PowerPoint took me, like, fucking forever. Why are you staring at me? Why are you staring Was at me? Was that a... No. No, look. Look. You can't save. You can only save on the computer. Oh, no. That's what that was referencing. Okay, okay. I wasn't calling you out. I was like... Also, check. I use this computer to take the test. You sure did, buddy. You sure did. Now go get some eats. So, uh, fun fact. Uh, this house layout is based on a house of a dog I sit. Oh. Bella's house. Oh! Yeah, the little Maltese. Now that you... I'm looking at it. Yeah, that looks very similar. And yeah, there's, there's the... the there's a TV area. There's the back door and the table. And here's the bathroom under the stairs and the door. And the... T and the, uh, the dining room. Like, dining room with the, where she runs circles. Yeah, she, she runs circles around this table because she gets fed right here. Yeah, so that's, that's a fun factoid. Hmm, let's see. I wonder if I got any Hot Pockets left. Hot Pocket. There we go. Oh, shit! That's probably Philly. I left my phone on my computer. Heck, heck. I like how there's donuts and fruit next to him, and he doesn't... Do you want to eat that for dinner? I've had cereal for dinner. Ah, oh, god damn it! Just missed him. Looks like I left a voicemail. Well, I'll just call him back now. Hello? 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 This is Doug. <laughs> Hello, is that the hospital? Can you put me through my mother? She's ill in. Oh yeah, she's ill in. Hello? Yes, this is Doc. Get off the phone, dog! Deep cut. Hey, Philly. Sorry about missing your call. I just missed it. What's up? Uh. Feliciano? Uh, oops, uh, that, yeah. Sorry, here it is. Hello? Hey there, buddy. Did you ring me? I did. <laughs> did. Philly, did you get into the communal wine? My like wine Stella. <laughs> oh my god, you're parting it up. Oh, sad I missed out. Ready for me to come get you? Oh no. I was going to tell you my friend's going to drop me off later. Don't wait up for me. Where's the playing? You sure? We have a thing in the morning. You think he can handle a hearty night out and still be able to handle the meeting? Positive, positive. All right then. Party on, dude. I'll see you in the morning. Bye. Felly's dead. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> hmm. Well, I could probably 
eat my hot pocket and head to bed. At least one of us should be well rested. Should be done in the microwave by now. Philly's dead, isn't he? Philly's Why would you say dead. that? Oh my god! Hot pocket obtained. Let's fly. Well, by fly I mean walk. Also, up here is similar, because right here is the laundry room. Then over here is the bedroom. Da da. Check this one. I mainly use this computer for gaming. Because desktop's a lot easier to fucking use for gaming than a laptop. <laughs> Sorry, that's a deep cut for myself. Let's change it to jump jumps. Heart boxers. Ugh. The man has taste. Go to bed. Yeah. It's bedtime. I hate this. Oh, oh god, oh god, okay. The tension is bad enough. Oh. You don't need to cover your eyes. Huh. Is that the TV? That's where I turned it off. Eh, I'm gonna piss anyway. I'll go look. I use my phone light to get around. Yeah. Let's have a nice quick save, just in case. Also, yes, we can move diagonal. Oh, neat. Hmm. Some pups trying to save a kitten from a witch. One of those early morning kid shows or something. Weird. All right, back to bed. Wait. What? No one's watching it. Yeah, there's no one here. That TV was off when. We God damn it! That TV was off. <laughs> okay. What's fucking with me? Uh, that's new. Um, yes. Yeah, I came from the kitchen. Fuck it, I need a proper flashlight just in case I need to beat a robber with it. Should be one of my bedside tables. Let's investigate anyway. No. You I need, need to get my flashlight. flashlight. Uh, Goop. Uh, 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 uh. Red bird, look. <laughs> <laughs> Gumi. Guess the name of that bird. Mm. Ah, here it is. Oh god, I have chills, and we haven't even seen anything. Uh, save. To be safe. Alright, let's go kick its ass. <laughs> oh no. <gasps> yeah, that that's what America's sounding like right now. Shit! My phone battery! Light drained it dead! <laughs> flashlight! Flashlight! But then, what well, was was all in all the goop and the and the ooze and the what? Uh, what uh -huh. are you talking about? Huh. 
You know what? <laughs> Nothing. I think I was just looking at spooky stuff before bed again. Should've listened to you. Yeah, you should've. <laughs> Ugh, jeez, man, don't need to rub it in. Sorry. Hey, how about you split this cake with me? I brought it back in the church for us. Yeah, that sounds nice. Thanks, Philly. Maybe I should stop having Hot Pockets before bed, too. Granted, looking at unsolved crime cases for the majority of the day doesn't help either. No. <sighs> Getting some good sleep with Philly sounds like what I need. Good. I saw you convulsing on the side. You good? No, of course not. Eh. Huh? You okay? Yeah, you okay? <laughs> huh? What? Oh, oh yeah. I had a weird dream. I don't know what it was. Maybe no cake before bed next time. First the hot pocket, and now this. Mmm, yeah. How are you feeling, by the way? Any hangover? I'm done. I'm fine. Freaking Italians. Wish I had your bounce back after drinking. God. Hehe. <laughs> Years of practice. And thousands of livers. That said, you better get dressed. You have the meeting thing you're running. Oh! Oh, yeah! Let me get dressed and get something to eat. Hi. Good morning. You excited for you big meeting? I swear to God, I thought Lunar fixed that. Oh well. More nervous than anything. I didn't sleep too good. Ah, oh, don't worry. No matter what happens, if it turns out good or bad, we'll come home together and have a nice dinner. Aw. Thanks, Philly. I knew that. Hey, hey. Now go get dressed. I'll keep looking this way for your modesty. Since when did you care about modesty, Mr. Sleeps Naked? I wasn't last night! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but I'll, I'll go do a bear back. He said you're the prude. <laughs> Which, yeah, if you do talk to him on different sides, he will, like, be like, I'm gonna look this way so I don't mess with you. Let's get dressed. You're the Puritan. <laughs> okay, but am I wrong? Hello, handsome man. Wait, didn't you win it yesterday? Didn't you? Eh. It's the clean. <laughs> well, mine too. Fair enough, let's go. Let's save. Alright, let's go. Eh. Da da dee, da da dee. Gotta go to me. The. Fuck. Oh, should probably get some food before we head out. I'm hungry. Also, fun bit. Uh, running. Oh yeah, me too. They have a special sprite for running. Oh, he leans into it. Yeah. Run. Why are you running when I'm really hungry? D morning jog, man. I'm hungry. I'm hungry too. Donuts. Let's see. Ah, here we go. <laughs> Of course, you never know. Those donuts might be soap. I made... My donuts are... My soap are donuts. I have made that mistake many times. <laughs> All right, good to go. Right behind you. Literally. I'm starting to know something about Italy, and I don't like it. What? What's I'll up? tell you later. Okay. <laughs> Time to vroom vroom. I will... And if you say it's because his sprite is eyes closed, it has been eyes closed since the beginning. You can see it when he's walking out. So don't be like, oh, it's suddenly closed. His eyes are always closed. Anyway, uh, who first? Uh, well, let's see who's all here. Norway, Sweden, Romania, England, Germany, Canada, Belarus, and then Hungary at the top. 
Okay, how about we start from right to left? Clockwise. America, hello! Hi, Hungry! You seem in a good mood today. The complimentary coffee here is really nice. What did you stock it with? Carte Noir, Les Roux, Chabot Femil? Hmm? Oh, I actually started with McCafe Blend. It's not a Walmart now, ain't it great? How things been? Good, all things considered. You usually don't call me over much, so coming here is quite a treat. It's a damn shame. It usually is just meetings we see each other in. You should hang out more. You seem really cool. Oh, thank you. Maybe after this meeting we can talk more. That'd be awesome. Good. Al, is everything okay? What? Oh, you said, oh, you said yeah, I have Canada. I, yeah, that's right. Unless you want Canada? Uh, uh you get Canada. You're okay. fine. Yeah, well, no, if I had to make this meeting, but, well, you'll see. We'll make it better. Okay. No bear today? Hmm? Oh, Kumushu was having a spa day today. His fur is practically yellow from all the pollen out right now, so he's at home. Oh, makes sense. He's a polar bear, not a poo bear. Huh? Oh! Ha! Because poo bear is yellow. Ah! Made you smile. Alright, I'll get out of here. Yeah, yeah, get the fuck out of here. Blech. Hey there! Glad you can make it! Mm hmm. I think I might leave her be. I'm just happy she's here. I, I don't want to prod her with small talk and make her more mad. All right. I'm not mad, I'm just tired. Hmm? Didn't really come in with you. Where is he? Oh, he's in the waiting room. He wanted to come for moral support, but this really doesn't really involve him. Besides, spooky stuff spooks him, so I didn't want to spook him. Fair. Good lord, broaden your vocabulary. There's more than- oh my god, what happened to your jaw? He's just like that. He's just like that. Drowned rat. I am a drowned rat. There's more than just the word spook. So, what will this meeting be about? You said it was top secret, so I wasn't able to research the subject prior to this. Oh, don't worry about that. I have some take-home USB drives for everyone that has files. That has, bleh, that has files, charts, and a copy of my presentation with all my sites stated. What's that look for? Did I screw up? <laughs> don't get me wrong. I'm absolutely delighted at having such hearty research material from you. It's just... Why can't you be on top of things when it comes to the G8 meetings? If I said hyperfixation and executive dysfunction, would you believe me? I believe more that God has quote unquote nerfed you to be an idiot at your job or else we'd all be in big trouble. <laughs> I, I like that reason more. It's true though. You know, excuse me. <coughs> I have the consumption. <laughs> This is supposed to be my week of holiday, America. You best have a good reason for pulling me away from it. I do have a good reason, you'll see. Uh, okay, now just pass me the tea. So what you celebrating? Pardon? Well, you said you were doing holiday stuff, so w which holiday is it? It means a vacation, you nimrod! Holiday is another tip for going on vacation. <laughs> oh! Why didn't you just say so? I just did! Awesome. Here's the tea, man. <laughs> oh, is it near my birthday already? Spewing out blood everywhere? Well, uh, it is June 19th. Happy Juneteenth! Y yes, Th thank you. Uh, oh, but yeah, because my birthday is coming, so that's why you're starting to spew blood. That's unsanitary. How about you keep your big ol' handsome nose out of this? You think my nose is handsome? Oh my god, stop it! I didn't bring you guys here to fuck! You asked us here! <coughs> I'm not even gonna explain myself at this point, you know damn well why! Uh, I have him. Romania! Good to see ya! How's the best little vampire in the whole world doing? Bueno! Moldova's just fine, he's with Bulgaria while I'm out in the belt. I meant how you were doing, but cool. Oh, Flurry 
sorry about that. I'm doing just fine. Rooty tooty fresh and fruity, as you might say. That's a pancake flavor, but I'm definitely stealing that from my catchphrase now. Easy. <gasps> Ooh, I know what I'm doing after the meeting now. Hey, don't bother. You, it's the best laxative that's off the market. But it has a smiley face on it. <coughs> oh no. <laughs> blood. <laughs> yeah, black blood. Boy, is Ceiling gonna be jealous when he learns I got to attend the nation meeting and he did it. Don't brag. It's not nice. Papa! Thanks for coming on my invite, guys! Of, of course. It's an honor for the nation to be amongst his own kind for official business. And my papa's hair is pink! What's the business of the meeting anyway? You never said. I'll get to that soon, promise! It's because of your funky flesh flavor. Funky fresh hair. Uh, uh, you look flesh cool! Melon. I like your hair! Hopefully I'm not pulling you away from any other stuff, right? I got to skip class for this, so I'm good. You still need to do your homework when you get home. Ew, but I wanted... What about meeting paperwork I might have to do? I think you can survive five pages of a math workbook and whatever this meeting has. I seriously love the color they picked for Sweden, for Sweden's hair. That sort of like, I know every most people have had this sort of like blue sheen on their hair, and he has this very delicate pink, and it looks really pretty. Sorry, sorry, no, it's okay, it's okay. Man, welcome to being a nation. I didn't think nationhood had came with homework. Yes, it does. Don't worry, my stuff's easy peasy. You'll get back on Minecraft in no time. <laughs> shh, shh. One more. And we'll call it an episode. Get that child out of the mines! <laughs> hey. Hey! Glad to see you made it! I know it's a real long trip for you Scandinavians. I was nearby because of the magic meeting with the other two. It's the only reason I accepted to go. Cool! No wonder I was able to snag all three of you. I wouldn't want to miss my favorite nephew. I would. I should start the meeting now since Reaches I talked to everyone. over ruffle hair. <laughs> What kind of meeting were you having? Discussing a strange maelstrom that appeared in the- Oh! The one on the Norway Pavilion in Epcot, yeah? I love that ride! Sure, why not? It's so cool! Thanks for helping fund that, by the way! I know it's not really popular right now, but I'm sure it'll get its second win in no time, huh? <clears throat> sure, why not? Okay, we should probably save it there before we start the meeting. Fun fact for those who are like, but Maelstrom's gone. This takes place uh, in the mid 2000s, and it's stuff like G8 still being a thing, and Maelstrom is kind of hints to that because it's G7 a la 2014, so it's before that happened. Just a fun factoid. Okay, that's it. So next time, we get to start the meeting and see what this is. <laughs> see, I, it looks like he's been tracking uh, the uh, mail deliveries for some people. <laughs> but yes, it's gonna be for me. So, hey, have a good day, everybody. Bye. Bye. I'm glad the lights are on. <laughs> oh, don't worry. They'll be off soon. God damn it.